When it comes to the highest mountain in the world, most mines race straight to Mount Everest. But guess what? That's not entirely accurate. If we were playing a round of trivia, and the question was, what's the highest mountain in the world? The majority would probably answer Mount Everest, without a second thought. This belief has been etched into our minds, largely due to the media and the countless tales of daring climbers braving the harsh conditions to reach its peak. But the truth of the matter isn't as straightforward as it seems. The crux of the issue lies in how we define height. Is it simply the distance from base to peak, or is it the elevation above sea level? Depending on your perspective, Mount Everest might not be the tallest mountain after all. So, if Mount Everest isn't the highest, then which mountain takes the crown? Prepare to have your mind blown. The real titan of the mountain world is none other than Mauna Kea. This colossal peak is nestled in the heart of the Pacific on the big island of Hawaii. It stands tall, reaching an astonishing total height of over 33,000 feet from base to peak. That's nearly a mile higher than Mount Everest. But wait, you might be wondering if it's so tall, why isn't it recognized as the highest? Well, here's the catch. A majority of Mauna Kea is hidden beneath the ocean's surface. Yes, that's right, only about 13,700 feet of it is visible above sea level, leading to the common misconception that it's shorter than Mount Everest. Yet, if we measure from base to peak, from its true origin on the ocean floor, Mauna Kea outstrips Everest by a significant margin. So, in terms of sheer height, Mauna Kea dwarfs Mount Everest. But how does Everest still hold its reputation? Mount Everest, standing tall in the Himalayas, isn't as defeated as you might think. While Mauna Kea holds the title for the world's highest mountain measured from base to peak, Everest still reigns supreme in another category. When you measure the height of a mountain above sea level, Everest takes the crown. Rising approximately 29,000 feet above sea level, Everest's peak is higher than that of Mauna Kea, which stands just over 13,000 feet above the Pacific Ocean. It's this particular measurement that has earned Everest its long-standing reputation as the highest mountain. The paradox here lies in the perspective. From base to peak, Mauna Kea is tallest, but from sea level to peak, Everest rules. It's all about where you start measuring. So both mountains have their unique claims to the title of highest. But how do they stack up in other aspects? Beyond height, there's more to a mountain than meets the eye. Let's delve into a comparison. When it comes to climbing difficulty, Everest, with its extreme altitude and harsh weather, is arguably one of the most challenging climbs on the planet. Climbers must contend with ice falls, crevasses, and the notorious death zone, where the oxygen level is insufficient to sustain human life. On the other hand, Mauna Kea, while not as physically demanding, presents its own set of challenges. The climb is a grueling test of endurance as the mountain gradually ascends from sea level to over 30,000 feet. The deceptive simplicity of the climb means many underestimate the challenge it presents. In terms of weather conditions, Everest is infamous for its unpredictable and harsh weather. Temperatures can drop to minus 60 degrees Celsius, and winds can reach hurricane levels. Mauna Kea, while not as extreme, experiences a wide range of weather from tropical at the base to arctic conditions at the summit. Biodiversity is where Mauna Kea shines. Its slopes are home to numerous endemic species, while Everest's severe conditions mean it supports less biodiversity. As for cultural significance, both mountains are deeply respected. Everest is revered in Tibetan culture, while Mauna Kea holds great importance to the native Hawaiian people. It's clear that both mountains, each remarkable in its own way, offer experiences as diverse as their geographies. So, who's the true champion in the Battle of the Mountains? Let's recap. Mauna Kea, measured from base to peak, outstrips Everest, making it technically the tallest. But Everest, with its height above sea level, holds the record for the highest altitude. It's like comparing apples and oranges, each unique and impressive in its own way. In the end, it's not just about the height. Both Everest and Mauna Kea command respect and awe, each a titan in its own right.